after attack. It does amaze me when that's the case. And one of the reasons why we get so many great Canadian comics, particularly, I think more Canadians than Americans, but so many of the really great mm. Canadian comics spend at least some time in the UK is because they can do... They make money at it. Yeah, you know, if you're booked at the comedy store in London, you're getting good money for those. And there's the early show at 8 o'clock and the late show at midnight. And in between that, within walking distance, you can do another two shows. I think that's ridiculous to me. Like, four shows in the night. I get... Yeah. I, it just trips me up if I do two shows tonight because did I do that joke earlier? The one, I, it, does, it has screwed me up a few times. I've had some almighty deaths doing... Um, it's the third show. In fact, twice in the last maybe 18 months, I had a really, really bad gig on the third show of a night because what had happened was the first show had been good, the second show had been great, and... I'd gone on to the third show just with that confidence of kind of going, yeah, this is, this is going to be great. This is going to be amazing. And I kind of forgot that I had to win over a new audience again. Uh, you sort of forget that you're going to a gig and they don't know you yet and you haven't got to that point in the middle of the show when you're kind of flying. And instead, it was just kind of just go on, relax, just chat and realize, oh, I haven't got a laugh for a minute. And then that kind of familiar feeling that every comic knows. And if they don't, they're, they're not a good comic. Yeah. <laughs> like if anyone, if any comic ever tells you they've never had a bad gig, oh, what it means is they've never had a good gig. Yeah. Because they don't it's have that comparison point. But there's that feeling where you just kind of feel, it's almost like a boat just kind of drifting out of your reach. It's just yeah. kind of like... And you, you just, just noticed it, it now. It's just go, yeah, and it's just out of reach and you can only just watch it go further and further. <laughs> <laughs> it's just... <laughs> you just feel it. It's, it's it's a visceral thing when you have a bad gig. You can f every part of you feels yeah. it. It's I know. I've got jokes where if I feel that that like it might be coming on, I've got jokes. I know like if they don't like this is a pretty you know across the boards joke. If these people hate this joke, then I'm fucked. Right. Yeah. This is normally That's my barometer it's, joke. It's when you've moved your closer up to the kind of six minute mark. Yeah. <laughs> you just start sweating, and, it, and that gets a half laugh, and you go, "Well, that's that that's." That's as good as it's gonna get. Yeah. <laughs> do it now. Now do I? Do I do my time or do I just bail out now or do I blame them? <laughs> <laughs> Laugh attack. <laughs>